one of Philippine basketball's microwaves has pulled the plug on his career. Barely 24 hours after San Miguel Alab Pilipinas lights were shut off in Hong Kong, 11 year pro Josh Urbas Tondo announced that he has decided to hang up his shoes and move on to the next stage of his life. After a long thought decision and discussing with my wife, I have finally decided to hang him up and retire from basketball. In my 11-year pro career there has been a lot of ups and downs which I will cherish and bring with me in my next chapter of life," Urbizantoto's statement on his Instagram read. In his last game, the six-foot spark plug finished with 11 points, built on three triples. Fell short this season, but so thankful for this opportunity with such a great group of guys. Thanks to my teammates and to the coaching staff of MCC Kuhn, Eric Menk, Danny Sagel, MC Evolution, and especially Jimmy Alapag. Thank you Charlie Dye, it was an honor playing for you in my last year," he expressed. Definitely, Urbas Tondo had one exciting career. The Cager born in San Francisco, California went undrafted in the 2009 PBA rookie draft after coming off stints in Foothill College and Fresno Pacific. The combo guard went on to sign with the STA. Lucia Realtors, posting norms of 7.8 points, 2. 8 rebounds, 2.6 assists, and 1.1 steals per game to be part of the all-rookie team. After moving from Sta, Lucia and the AIR21 Express, Urbas Tondo was able to get his first taste of gold during the 2012 Commissioner's Cup, winning the championship with the B-Meg Lamatos. He would then be shipped from team to team, playing for Baraco Bull Energy Drink, Barangay Ginebra San Miguel, and Phoenix Fuel Masters. His last stop in the PBA was with the Global Port Bat Tank Pair in 2018. But before his second stint with Global Port, he was signed by the Singapore Slingers in 2017. In the last two years of his career, he played for San Miguel Alab Pilipinas, winning the championship in the eighth season of the regional league. With his kids growing up, Urbis Tondo, who has proven that he still has a lot left in his tank, has decided to move back to California. I know I have a couple more years left in my tank, but those of you who have kids and a family know that sacrifices must be made for them," he admitted. I have not lost love for the game, everything I do is for my family. Those of you who know me my kids and wife are everything to me, and as a father I have to think what's best for them. Moving back to the States is essential for my family at this moment, and I am excited for our next chapter in